I'm just hanging out with Mags in my studio today. Oh my gosh, so I don't know if you've been paying attention. She's like, what are you doing? <laughs> I don't know if you've been paying attention to my last few videos, but I've been doing all these reviews on the Prima watercolor sets. You can binge them all if you like, but there's things I like about every set and things I don't like about every set. But I just have to say, I have to go on record and say that I found my favorite. And I can say that because I've tested all of them pretty much. And I am obsessed with this new one. It's Tropicals. Okay, it's not new. It's new to me though. It's Tropical Colors. And you'll see a quick time lapse of me creating this. But this glow, like the colors are so rich and beautiful. I was in absolute heaven. My last video was on the pastel, the vintage pastel set. And it was like the opposite. Like the colors were like so incredibly light. And I really loved how like the project came together at the end. Um, and you can click to go watch it. But like this one just like fed my soul. And it was like what I want watercolors to be for me, which is like punchy, bright, obnoxiously vibrant colors. And this tropical set totally did it for me. So I'll introduce you to the palette, why I like them. And then you can just see a quick version of this project come to life just for shits and giggles. And you can binge the whole series and find what sets you like or don't like. And let me know in the comments below if you have any of them, which ones are your favorites? I would really genuinely love to know. Also, if anyone has the classics set, um, let me know if that's worth purchasing. The only one that doesn't like float my boat just from like going on Amazon is the Odyssey set. The colors are not, I'm not loving them. So if anyone also has the Odyssey set and wants me to just buy them anyways and test them, or if there's something that you've created with the Odyssey set, if you want to link to like your Instagram post or whatever, let me know because I would love to see what you've done with those colors. So without further ado, I want to introduce you to Prima's Tropical Watercolor Set. All right, in full transparency, I actually took the time to film the unpacking of this, the individual unwrapping of all the colors, and I somehow mis deleted that all that content off my camera. I am so sorry. To be honest though, watching someone unveil all these is actually super boring. So let's cut to the chase anyway, shall we? Here are these amazing, vibrant colors. First of all, the names are adorable. Secondly, I, I don't even know if my light can justify how rich and vibrant this collection of watercolors is. Now, my video is not sponsored. So I am no one's paying me to say any of these nice things. Just to be like crystal clear, I spend all my own money on all of these sets and I really give you my honest opinions that way. I freaking love this set so, so much. So, and just to show, in case you haven't seen any of my other product reviews, it is, and hopefully this is a really obvious thing I'm about to say, you can't judge these colors by the colors they should appear in the pan. Do you know what I mean? Like that looks like black. That looks like, I don't know, navy blue. Like you would never be able to tell what these colors were unless you swatched them. So the little sets, all these little sets by Prima come with this awesome swatch card, which is on perfectly thick, I don't think it's watercolor paper, but Bristol at least. So you can really swatch, a, actually a pretty big size swatch for every color. So make sure, sure, sure that you do that. Wash your brush thoroughly between each color so you don't get any contamination. And then you can sneak this inside and you're ready to go. And then just to share, since again, you, you would have missed this. I also have, just FYI, this skinny swatch book. This is actually a really skinny, narrow watercolor paper book. Um, and I will link to it in the description box for you. But I like to take all my sets and I swatch them in one place. That way, no matter what little set I'm taking, with me, I do. I run annual art retreats in Scotland. I can grab any of my sets, any of them, and then I just grab my same single book and I have all my swatches here for me in one place. That's the Premature Rain set. There's the Woodland set. There's the Essence set. There's the Complexion set. Ah, ooh. There's the Vintage Pastel set, and there's the new Prisma Tropicals. So I'll show you how these come to life within a project. If you are looking for a vibrant, gorgeous set of bright, saturated watercolors, I really do totally recommend the Tropical set. I love it. 